Follow BYU Sports Nation on social. We're on Facebook, X, Instagram, YouTube, and TikTok. Welcome back to Studio B. I am Spencer. He is Jerem. Let's roll out the Tuesday headlines. Men's Hoops host number 11 Baylor tonight. Cougs 6-6 six six in league play. Baylor in third place at 8-4. and four. The Bears beat uh, BYU in Waco 81-72 on January 13th. Free game starts at 8 Eastern tonight. BYU TV, BYU Radio. In the AP poll, Cougars dropped six spots but stayed in the poll. And number 25, Joe Lenardi's Bracketology. The Cougars still a six seed playing Texas A&M. Let's avenge the 08-09 losses. Let's go, in the man. Interim. Get it done. Lauren Gustin. Once again, named the Big 12 Player of the Week. How about that? Two weeks in a row, she averaged, averaged 27 and a half points a game, 16 and a half rebounds, and had a career high 33 points in that loss against Kansas. Gustin and BYU back to work tomorrow night when they host TCU. Pro Football Focus had four Cougars on its 2024 NFL Draft Big Board of 320 players. Kingsley so Suomati at 46, Keaton Slovis at 286, Isaac Rex at 287. And Ryan Rico, as Mr. Irrelevant on this list at least, 320. BYU baseball drops their final game of the MLB Desert Invitational to Grand Canyon last night by a final of 6-2. to two. Up next for the Batcats, a road game at Cal tomorrow. And men's volleyball dropped two spots in this week's ABCA poll to number 8 after two losses last week to Grand Canyon. First time in 22 years, the same team came in on a weekend and swept BYU in both matches. Crazy, Crazy. right? Number four, UCLA comes to Provo for a pair of matches this weekend. Friday and Saturday, 9 Eastern on BYU TV. There's no Utah right in men's volleyball. UCLA is this, the rival. Th that is the rival for sure. That's a great comparison. Just get one of them. Come on. Those are today's headlines.